Welcome back. This is Mental Health Awareness Week and Mississippi University for Women is educating students and staff about the help available on campus and in the community. The director of the school's counseling center says that the pandemic has only increased cases of anxiety and depression on college campuses. WCBI Stephen Pimpo has more on the resources for students and staff. We've all miss our normal and we have no idea what normal will be again. That's the feeling that exists at college campuses across the country as the COVID-19 pandemic lingers on. Because of a COVID year, uh, we've had a lot of concern, not only on campus, but nationally as far as suicide. Dr. Deb Wells, director of the Counseling Center at the Mississippi University for Women, says that the events of the past nearly two years have taken their toll on both students and faculty. The anxiety and depression is what's really what we're seeing a lot of. Not that we didn't see it before, but we're seeing a lot of it now. Since the start of the fall semester, the Counseling Center says they've had about 40 more visits than usual, a significant increase for a student body of this size. Which is why Dr. Wells and the Counseling Center held a new mental health awareness event Thursday, featuring booths from various local agencies where students and staff could learn about the services they offer. Let students know what's available. Participants included community counseling services. We have two different facilities, and um, we also um, offer mental health services, lots of mental health services. Baptist Memorial Hospital Golden Triangle. Baptist Behavioral Health and the W have a partnership um, to offer students um, free psychiatric care. Um, their first six visits are free and student organizations on campus. Getting physically fit or just, you know what I'm saying, enjoying a game with my friends, it allowed me to just take a moment away from life. I'm not worried about what's going on, I'm not worried about the ups and the downs. Sophomore Caitlin McGree says it's comforting to know just how many places she and her classmates can turn if they need help. Counseling centers help me a lot, and they've given some good advice about, like, if we need help with anxiety, because I have anxiety, if I ever need anything, I can go to anybody really if I'm feeling homesick or isolated or depressed. In Columbus, Stephen Pimpo, WCBI News. Dr. Wells says the goal is to make this an annual event where they can add more health agencies across the Golden Triangle every year. For more information on mental health treatment options, you can visit our website, WCBI.com.